Suella Braverman accused Rishi Sunak of betrayal in a blistering attack on his weak leadership yesterday. Holding nothing back, the former Home Secretary, who was sacked on Monday, said Mr Sunak was rejected by party members. She said it was only the backing she gave in October 2022 that secured him the premiership. But she claimed Mr Sunak had manifestly and repeatedly failed to help her deliver. She also claimed he never had any intention of taking the action needed to stop the small boats. In an extraordinary letter, Mrs Braverman said the PM had put off tough decisions in order to minimize political risk to yourself. She added, in October of last year you were given an opportunity to lead our country. It is a privilege to serve and one we should not. Service requires bravery and thinking of the common good. It is not about occupying the office as an end in itself. Someone needs to be honest. Your plan is not working. We have endured record election defeats. Your resets have failed and we are running out of time. You need to change course urgently. The Prime Minister's decision to sack Mrs Braverman and shift the party to the centre has provoked fury on the right. Different factions are working together to show their anger and demand the PM sticks to the agenda that won over vote. Number 10 was warned it is facing a grid of S asterisk asterisk over the coming days, a reference to plans by the right of the party to try to dominate the news agenda. Downing Street insisted Mr Sunak believes in actions not words after Mrs Braverman issued her letter. A number 10 spokeswoman said, the Prime Minister was proud to appoint a strong, united team yesterday, focused on delivering for the British people. The Prime Minister believes in actions not words. He is proud this government has brought forward the toughest legislation to tackle illegal migration this country has seen and has subsequently reduced the number.